material unloading and storage. Ensuring safety during the unloading and storage of chemical raw materials is crucial to prevent accidents, spills, and other hazards. Here are safety instructions for chemical raw material unloading and storage. Pre-planning Develop a comprehensive plan for unloading and storage procedures, taking into account the specific properties and hazards of each chemical raw material. Personal Protective Equipment PP. All personnel involved in unloading and storage must wear appropriate PPE, including chemical-resistant gloves, goggles, face shields, aprons, and any other necessary protective gear. Emergency Response Establish and communicate emergency response procedures, including the location of emergency exits, eye wash stations, safety showers, and the proper use of fire extinguishers. Training Ensure that personnel involved in unloading and storage are adequately trained on handling chemical raw materials, recognizing potential hazards, and using safety equipment. Ventilation Ensure proper ventilation in the unloading area to disperse potentially harmful fumes. Use mechanical ventilation systems and open doors or windows to promote airflow. Spill containment Have spill containment measures in place, such as absorbent materials, spill kits and barriers, to quickly respond to and contain any spills that may occur during unloading. Grounding and bonding Ground and bond containers and equipment to prevent static electricity buildup which can lead to sparks and potential ignition sources. This is particularly important when handling flammable materials. Inspection of containers Before unloading, inspect containers for damage, leaks or any signs of deterioration. Ensure that containers are compatible with the stored material and meet safety standards. Proper handling equipment Use appropriate handling equipment, such as forklifts or pallet jacks, to move and store chemical raw materials. Ensure that the equipment is in good working condition and suitable for the specific material being handled. Segregation Store different chemical raw materials separately based on their compatibility. Follow guidelines for segregating incompatible substances to prevent chemical reactions. Labeling Clearly label all containers with the correct chemical names, hazard warnings and any other required information. Ensure that labels are legible and intact throughout the storage period. Inventory Management Implement a systematic inventory management system to track incoming chemical raw materials. Regularly audit and update inventory records to prevent overstocking or discrepancies. Security measures Restrict access to the chemical storage area to authorized personnel only. Implement security measures, such as surveillance cameras and access controls, to prevent unauthorized entry. Material Data Sheets MSDS Maintain updated Material Safety Data Sheets MSDS, for all stored chemical raw materials. Make these documents easily accessible to personnel and emergency responders. Waste Disposal Develop proper procedures for the disposal of empty containers and any waste generated during the unloading process. Comply with local regulations for waste management. By following these safety instructions, you can minimize risks associated with chemical raw material unloading and storage, creating a safer working environment for all personnel involved. This is all about today's topic. Thanks for watching Funny EHS Info. And don't forget to subscribe our channel to get immediate notification of our videos. Share our videos to your friends and colleagues to create safety awareness. If you have any questions and requirements please comment in comment box.